Yeah, 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 and actually it's like so early right now i'm honestly just rushing on my bed <laughs> make up brush my teeth wash my face put on one top and say you know what i promise you guys that i will record it so i'm gonna record it my hope my face now no matter no you know i'm gonna put on no i'm gonna leave that but yeah it's like 8 20 right now and i got a call in my sleep as probably you can hear me kind of still so sleepy that girl, the results are out. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> Guys, instantly me have to go about you. I don't know why every time I'm nervous, I have to go about you. So I say, you know what? Let me just put myself a little bit decent so that I can come on camera and show you guys my reaction. So, yeah. This is not even going to be. I have just record this and post it. I mean, I edit it. I mean, I think so. I mean, I, I mean, I don't know. This is just I mean, I to show you guys. So, um, what may I say? First, to recap. So, yeah, I did my program, graduated. So, why am I doing these exams? So, first things first, if you guys would have been following up with my videos, as you should be. Um, in my step to take after graduation video, I told you guys that to be qualified for your permanent residence, your occupation title had to fall under NOC class 0A or B and technician falls under um, NOC occupation title B. Second thing, if you complete the program, Yes, you graduate, but to be um, registered by the Pharmacy Board of Canada, you have to pass these exams to use the title Registered Pharmacy Technician. If you don't pass these exams and do the other little stuff that needs to be done, then you're only qualified as an assistant. So you're probably like, why don't you just be an assistant? Because one, assistants don't get paid that well. And two, technicians have a wider what will I say like job choice they have wider job choices we're not just limited to pharmacy there's hospitals there's um long-term care homes there's agencies there's so many places that we can work it's not just pharmacy so yeah that's why I decided that I had to get registered because my biggest thing is for my permanent residence and yeah you know girl want oh san kara so you know so me need that me need that you know so it's out so i'm gonna be checking right now i hope that whatever the results are if it's that i passed i will humbly accept the results and if i didn't then i pray that i'll find peace with knowing that that's just life sometimes you have up sometimes you have downs and there's always um next year april for me to redo but yeah let's check that guys we're more tall dry <laughs> we're more tall dry so we're nervous we're nervous we're nervous we're not lying so i'll probably do a screen recording so you guys can see um what i'm doing here so i have to go on to the PBC website which is pharmacy examining pharmacy examining board of Canada and I have to look for my number because otherwise I would have to wait two weeks from today to get the email to say whether or not I passed. So my number is 317-294. So we're gonna have to go on a, we're gonna scroll through the list and see if we see 317-294. I'm gonna do the practical first which is called the OSPI. So we're gonna check that one first. <laughs> yes, I found it. I found it on that one. But no, I'm checking first because I was more confident in that one. 
so now we have to check the multiple choice <laughs> okay <laughs> never was look at me that's like short Series okay if you don't if you don't pass again just redo it in April. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. So that's what I expected for sure. I didn't get the MCQ, but I got the practical. So April, I'll have to redo that one. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. So yes, guys, that's me checking so i have to go again in april to do this one actually I, d I never wanted to do it again because if you guys don't remember when i gave you my update video i was so nervous like yo that was one of the worst feelings in my life but yeah i have to go again in april so yeah i'll catch you guys then or i'll keep you guys updated i should say